Tennessee, so it should be a good couple best of fives. And I'm excited, not just because Winston and I have the same glasses, but because <laughs> is uh, that worthy of excitement? Uh, you know, in my world, yeah, I guess. So you're just stealing fashion from a gorilla now. <laughs> no, he stole from me. I've been wearing these glasses for years, man. <laughs> he, I, I suppose only that's popped true because he's yeah. in the future, so he must have actually watched vods of you <laughs> that's from the right. past to get style tips. I'm the trendsetter. What can I say? <laughs> Gorillas on the moon. <laughs> love, moon love my style. <laughs> moon gorilla <laughs> fashion trendsetter. Doa. I always knew I had a you know a bright future in the fashion industry. I just didn't know what species for. <laughs> now I know. Or what space and time. Or what career, because they're scientists, not not monkeys. <laughs> Don't say it. Winston gets mad if you call him a monkey. Technically, he's a great ape, so he wouldn't be a monkey anyway. That's right. But first and foremost, he's a scientist. You know, that's the truth. And I'm curious uh, what our delay is here, Noah. Me too. Yeah, we're really spending a lot of time talking we, here. So. Hey, we could show shots of the players for a while, I guess. Just we could. Scan down the line one by one by one. Yeah. Adam's wanting to, wondering too. He's like, uh, uh, what's up? Maybe the network itself is just in shock from today's events. Who knows? We need someone to make this network great again. <laughs> well, Sombra, Sombra is here. I guess. Well, that's not a good thing for the network, though. It, maybe it is. You how don't long? know her motive. Well, she can fix the network, too. At Noah. this point, we really don't know how long she will be here. <laughs> she, might, she might get uh, kicked up pretty fast, fast by her. Well, find out, guys. <laughs> Time to get in the games. <laughs> RG Titan <laughs> versus a freak of freaks. Blue, let's get in the game. Now, as we uh, go towards the break, we look forward to our next match. Kung Nuncia taking on Energy Esports. Siegel and the gang in the booth when we come back. Seagull and the flock. This break. Seagull and the flock, you're right. <laughs> the, the flock of Seagull, if you will. They uh, Hopefully they won't run too far away during the bro. Is that a flock of Seagulls? I don't know. I don't know, man. I don't know either. That was maybe a little bit before my time even. Who knows? Our battleground, of course. And you know what? Nepal. I'm a little bit upset with Sombra, Sombra Monte Cristo, because she stole Lucio's poop. I mean, I know she steals things. That's kind of what she does. But still. Hey, she stole know, Bastion's poop. In the past. <laughs> well, I mean, you know, Lucio had the poop, right? The right click and knock people off. Now Sombra's saying poop in the video. Yeah, but that's, Bastion's that's only on. word is words are boops. No, well, he can say beep, too. <laughs> and blip. <laughs> Oh, okay. And I don't know how things do. Make sort of screeching sounds when he dies, I guess. But yeah, so I say make Boop great again. Give it back to Lucio Sombra. Come on. In the future, Jeeps will have tilted wheels on the side. Oh, nice. Yeah. I don't understand how the, the tilted wheels is more efficient for hovering. You'd think they'd go I'm straight sure down either. or something. But I guess in, well, in park mode, they could be easily pushed from side to side if they were straight down. So. You know, maybe if they're angled like that, it helps you sort of keep an even hover going. <laughs> Whereas if they're just pointed straight no, down, you I can think, tip I think left it's just and right easier. I just think they're parked, so you know that way you can't just push it very easily. Although yeah, parallel, parallel parking would be a lot easier with a hover That's true. car that could just slide right in. The At thing 90 is, degree though, angles. I have an answer to this question because when the payload starts moving on this map, the wheels stay in the same position. Oh god! Boom! Trumpy there. I did, well, we all got trumped. It's, today, got a, it's a whole new meaning <laughs> for that. One, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> and then, I we know you made a promise before. Could you tell us about it? And your mustache and your beard is that is that stake right now? Well, it feels good to win, but as I promised, I promised to shave off all of my facial hair if I win, and so I have to do it now. No! No! So next time no, you see me, I won't have any facial hair. Beard. Hair. Eska on his own lands a flashbang, but he needs a little bit more than that. There's a primal rage now as Gamsu comes charging in. Although he's not doing a ton of damage here, Gamsu not being very effective. Bye. <laughs> that was a bit awkward. All right. Well, in the meantime, he's so Ninja angry. Kai killed everybody else. He's like, "All right, I'm done." <laughs> so angry he's to gonna... the wilderness. <laughs> he's escaping into the That's African right. plains, Stella. He's a gorilla. His home are the, is the African mountains of the Congo. So right, but we're we're on the plains though. This looks more like the Serengeti. Yeah, he's got a long way to go. He does. He's he's gonna <laughs> he's gonna leave his way he's, home every three seconds or so. He's got a long way to go from Kenya to. Uh, all the way into Rwanda or the Congo or, or the like Congo. That. Our our observers are are pretty good, I think. But they they did the ultimate kill the caster move last match. They switched from Genji to Genji. No, you never do that. I know you can't switch from one hero 
to the exact same here on the other team, especially when they're both alting. <laughs> yeah, that's a big no-no. Yeah. That doesn't doesn't make our lives easy, does it? Well, I mean, I'm fine. You're the one has to do play by play. I know, yeah. <laughs> doesn't make my life easy. Just makes you laugh. It does. Makes me sad. <laughs> It's my Schadenfreude Go ahead. moment. Take take joy I, in my I'm, pain. I am. I am. <laughs> Schadenfreude is strong with me, though, as you know. We've cast together for years now. Well, you and your hubris may eventually <laughs> struggle with something <laughs> at some point. I struggle with many things, but play by play, <laughs> I fortunately do not have, have to, to worry struggle about with that. that. <laughs> yeah. Lucky you. Yeah, I struggle with casting with you, Dylan. That's. Oh, <laughs> come on. <laughs> you know that's not true. No, you're great. I know. <laughs> I Han solo you there. <laughs> I know. You you Han solo me so hard. I All know. right, <laughs> let's get into this. And welcome back to the Intel Overwatch Apex Season 1. Signs from the fans and a that sign. That is creepy. That is creepy. <laughs> May, May is creepy. I mean, what do, you, what do you want, man? She's the creepiest character in Overwatch. And that's a cast of characters that includes Junkrat. May I remind you? <laughs> Man, I wish fighting. they would show the really good reunited side that's here today. There is an amazing reunited sign. Yeah, there is. We also have some cosplayers too. I see a McCree and I believe a Soldier 76. Nice. Yeah. That's who I would cosplay as. So we have the same hairline. <laughs> <laughs> Convenient. It is, it is, isn't it? I'm getting too old for being good at video games. <laughs> Well, we we both are, man. We both yeah. are. That's why we get to enjoy this instead. That's right. I like it. I like it from here. This seat is better. Welcome to Volskaya Industries, man. If people only knew that Volskaya herself was getting the technology from the Omnics, man, uh -huh. people would be mad. Would they? Is that They'd really be so mad? They didn't really explain in the Sombra video why that's a problem, Bella. Yeah, exactly. That's that's why I was kind of confused about. Well, first of all, I have two questions there. One is why would the Omnics do this in the first place? Or were these like good Omnics that were like, hey, we want to give you this to fight against the bad Omnics? Or why, were why these are like the bad Omnics? Maybe they're like, maybe Volskaya is going to like turn against everybody. It's like a, a Matrix situation where the guy's like, put me back in the Matrix. I want to eat fake steak. Why do you assume that bad Omnics are the ones that want to kill humans? Maybe those are the good Omnics. They're reading, maybe. they're returning everything to nature. People you are know, destroying the earth. Global warming is a pretty exactly. serious thing, man. And, I, you're and making a lot of assumptions bodies are right cold. there. You're making a lot of assumptions. Well, I prefer I prefer to think of the Omnics that kill everybody as good Omnics. You right? want to just put your brain in a robot body somewhere, huh? <laughs> Ghost in the shell <laughs> situation here. I'm cool with that. All right, well, we'll keep that in mind. <laughs> All right, here we go. Looks like we've got Luxury Watch Blue on the offense, reunited on the defense for our first round here on Watchpoint Gibraltar. But who watches the watch point? <laughs> That's the question. Do you know that fr the know who watches the watchman <laughs> phrase in Latin? Uh, no, no, I don't. That's a very <laughs> random question you just asked me. No. Well, that's where it comes from. That's why I was asking. I, I do not know who watches the Watchmen in Latin, but I've got a feeling you're about to tell us all. <laughs> I'm trying to remember it exactly that I took. I think it's oh, uh, quiz custodiate. <laughs> Ipsos Custodes, I think is that what sounds, it is. That sounds right to me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> sounds good. <laughs> Latin lessons with Monte Cristo. <laughs> I have a wealth of information. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's right. See, it's usually not a good follow-up if you're like, hey, do you know this thing? And they're like, wait, let me see if I remember it. <laughs> uh, no. I was just checking because I didn't know if my memory was perfect, though. So I thought okay. maybe you might remember it so I could check myself. I, I know it in English. <laughs> I can't check you though. Not with that Latin. Sorry. <laughs> the only Latin I know is what the uh, <laughs> Little Caesars Pizza guy said. <laughs> and that was just pizza pizza. <laughs> also not I'm Latin. So there you go. Sure it was, I'm pretty sure it was Latin <laughs> for pizza pizza. You know, well, when in Rome. Electro Rush Blue taking the high ground. <laughs> As the payload gets pushed forward, that was just like a uh, Dada art style expressionist <laughs> conversation there. Nice job. That's what we do. All right, well, here comes Luxury Watch Blue. A clever little engage using the May Wall. They're going to get to the high ground very quickly and start to poke as the payload starts rolling or floating. The payload.
payload starts floating. <laughs> That doesn't does, sound does as it, good. Doesn't sound as good. Though. It doesn't sound as smooth. We're all about the smooth it, casting here, right? The smooth casting. Oh yeah. I like the smooth jazz. Indeed. The smooth jazz. I like jazz, but smooth jazz is truly awful. <laughs> <laughs> you like epic sax man for ten hours. <laughs> we know. No, I just I don't <laughs> want Kenny G. I want Charlie Parker. There's a difference there. Huge difference. Ah, uh, there is. Yeah. I never thought I'd uh, hear Kenny G reference an Overwatch cast, but here we are. I, there's a lot of things that happened this week that I never thought would happen, but, but here we are. On, on everything, I mean, his hero pool's been super good. Unfix there with a crucial kill onto the Deadeye McCree, and then, yeah, and it was good to see Unfix's uh, Maybach as well. Oh, and then he got trapped on that the That was so sad. <laughs> yeah, nothing, uh, nothing more painful to watch than a cybernetic ninja desperately trying to hop up a, hop up a slippery ice wall. <laughs> he could use his, uh, his little dagger that he melees with as an ice pick, you know? You'd think so. As like an ice axe to get up. He's clearly never been ice climbing on frozen waterfalls before. Well, see, that was a weird moment because you could think he could also double jump his way out of there, so I, I don't know exactly what was happening there. I prefer that my was, theory. That was strange. <laughs> that he should just what? <laughs> that he should use his, uh, his melee dagger as, a, as an ice axe. I'm sure he's got all sorts of little tricks <laughs> packed away into that cybernetic body of his. He makes Deus Ex look like a toaster. <laughs> and just well, like what, Deus Ex, is, he didn't ask De for this. Who is Deus Ex? De obviously, he's a tiny-armed guy who's the star of the Deus Ex series. I can't believe you need, need to ask. I know you like those games. Noah just calls the, the main character of Deus Ex Deus Ex. Just so, you, just so you guys know, because that, that would have been very confusing if you didn't know that. No, man, Deus Ex, we all know about him. <laughs> Tiny Arm Protagonist. He means Adam Jensen, but it's Tiny okay. Arm Protagonist was the name of my uh, punk band in college, too. <laughs> oh, there's Reaper. With a, it's a very large head he's got there, but he's a thinking man's Reaper. <laughs> Put your feet up. Matches are over. Time to relax. And time to go out. to an MVP interview. Reaper's got no chill.